Welcome back, my adoring public, to more Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE. Pharaoh Fiasco here. Um, I don't even... I can't even begin to go over what we did last episode, because that was certainly a while ago. But Tiki's got a side mission up in front of her, so... Um, or, or on top of her head, so... Oh, okay. There's someone I want you to check up on. Would you listen to my request? Uh... I'll tiki tiki for you for reals. Or I'll tiki tiki you for reals. Sure. The side story has been accepted. Hmm. Sure. I don't know what tiki tiki somebody is supposed to mean, but. Okay. Okay. Tiki is my waifu. I honestly didn't expect that to show up in this game. I'm... Okay. Tiki equals waifu. <laughs> okay. That's an odd name. Duh, okay, I guess that bears explaining for people who really aren't in the know. Okay, they're a they're a god of the Utaloid program. She's <laughs> she's okay with this dude who, or this person, I guess. No clue if it's a guy that made her his waifu. For this waifu person. <laughs> I really <laughs> That's I'm not sure how this made it how that made it into this game. I'm legitimately surprised. The word waifu in a Nintendo game, who'd have thought? Cafe ka. Hmm. I think there's a cafe in Shibuya. If memory serves. Uh, what's Toma got to say? Uh Jeez, that illusory 106 Mirage fight really took a lot out of me. Kind of want to get some training done in the Idolosphere while we got some breathing room. Sound good? And then he sends, here I go. It's still showing that there are seven of them. Hmm. Oh, Subasa just sent us some, I think. Sorry, could you just forget all that stuff I said earlier? About Miss Maiko writing, uh, hiding something from me? I shouldn't talk about her like that. She really helped me when I had to save Aya. I owe her so much. I'm so ashamed of myself. And then Tiki also sent us a new topic. Oh, it's a topic about her side story. Big Brother, there's something I want to ask you to do. Could you come to the, uh, the Bloom Palace? And then she sends, like, her own emoji, where she's, like, freaking out. And then a map to show us where we're supposed to be at. Okay, um, so we'll do Tiki's, we'll do Tiki's thing, find out about Tiki equals waifu. <laughs> really now? I could, uh, I can just imagine the conversation surround, actually, I really can't imagine the conversation surrounding that. You may view the various trigger conditions for the arti uh, artist's side stories. Whose side story should I check up on? Um, Kiria's. <coughs> you must increase Kiria's stage rank before her side story will become available. To raise your cast member's stage rank, they must participate in combat more. Okay, so I have to fight alongside her. It is too soon for you to begin Subasa's side story. You must progress further in the main story before it will become available. Okay. And then Maiko's cancel. Huh. 
One side story can be active at a time. If you wish to start a new one, then the current one must be cancelled. You may accept cancelled side, story, uh, side stories again as much as needed, but you will always start them over from the beginning. When you cancel one, all key items and Performa acquired in will be lost. Definitely not about to do that. Can I? Okay, I was like, how can I back out of this? Received an urgent topic from Tiki. The person using a, a laptop with a Tiki sticker is Tiki equals waifu. Tiki equals waifu is usually at the cafe. And then a worried sticker from her. Um, let's talk to everybody here before you leave out. Hmm? I'm glad Ayaha's back. I was involved in the mass disappearance too, so I always wondered about the people who vanished. Hmm. From now on, I'll be supporting everyone in the office too, so let's do this together. And then, Maiko. <laughs> Don't forget about your lessons, okay? It's at the same place as last time, Barry's place in Shibuya. Okay, so we can always go there for more of a for more of hanging out with Barry, I guess. Shibuya and then Karabia. There it is. Was I thought Karabia was a jewelry shop though, rather than a place where we could uh rather than a cafe. But more than likely I'm misremembering. Probably. As soon as this loads, we'll be able to find out. This is definitely the jewelry shop. Hmm. So there, the the other place. Um, where is it? Oh, Subasa. <laughs> I'm so glad my sister is okay. Now that I don't have to worry about her, I can relax and enjoy shopping again. I mean, which is all well and good, but this cafe though. It should be more towards this. There we go. I wonder if Toma's thing, where he wants to train in between in between story uh, missions, counts as like a counts as a side story. Oh, we can push people out of the way. Okay. Kind of rude, but we're still trying to get to where we need to go at the end of the day. Where actually was this place? Here it is. It should be. Is that Toma? No. On the Vulgar Man. Uh, the concert's over. Oh, okay. I mean, it's nothing to do with me anyway. And I think the cafe... This is... Ramen. And it's somewhere... Here we go. This should be it. And then Tiki equals waifu should be in here. So nothing like that just yet? Okay, so they saw him leaving. So now we're gonna grill them about Tiki. Oh, just listen in. Oh, Chrome's gonna help? We're ultra serious about this. Walking around the 106. He was spirited away. I, we probably have to go into um, the idolosphere to rescue him. Okay. Into the idolosphere we go. We'll take Toma and Kiri, uh, Kiria too. Oh, a new topic. Tiki, do you have a moment? Did you find Tiki equals waifu? No, but someone saw Tiki equals waifu disappear near the 106. You don't think? Yeah, the idolosphere might be involved. I'm worried, so I'm going to check out the 106. I'll contact you if anything changes, so wait for me, okay? Oh. Mm hmm? 
no, it's nothing. Uh, be careful. And then she's like, you can do it. Is it going to take us immediately there, or do we have to walk there? I'd be fine with either, honestly. But it's probably going to just take us right there. Nope. Uh, what is this? Cafe Satan? Cafe A latte isn't real coffee. I keep hearing people say that, but as long as it tastes good, it shouldn't matter, right? Uh... Well, there are times when I'm in the mood for dark coffee. And at times when I'm in the mood for something really sugary and iced. Not too sugary, though. There's there's uh, such thing as way too much. And it's easy to pass that point with coffee, in my particular uh, experience. That's Barry. We're not going to hang out with him just yet. Oh, my God. Wait. Is this a little girl? Receives a topic from Maiko. Tsubasa has been working really hard. He thinks so too, right, Itsuki? I guess now it's my turn to answer her efforts with mine. And then she sends like a fired up plue. Oh, the girl, right. Konnichiwa! Shiba is a really fun town. They shoot TV stuff here all the time. Okay, no, she wasn't super extra lost or anything. She was just out and about. Wait. The I okay, we have to cross this way to get to the Idolosphere. Alright, let's walk right past Tsubasa. And entrance to the Idolosphere. What should I do? Yep, we're gonna go inside. And, um... Kiria and Tomo should already be in our party, honestly. But we should get a little scene ex expounding on what we're actually doing here, I'm assuming. Yep. How is it? Right, they are talking. So we're gonna have to fight a boss to save this guy? Ah, this shouldn't be too bad. Received the topic from Tiki. Uh, it's another one of her side story ones. Big brother! It's weak, but I sense Performa up above! I don't feel any presence of any mirages nearby, so they might be alone in a large area. Uh, if only I could also... Okay, so... Yep, everybody's level 15. So I guess we have to just go further up. Uh, alone in a large area. I've forgotten a lot about the layout of this place, so let's just start from the top and work our way down. And besides, the mirages down there might be extremely weak, so... And then... This way, maybe? Alone in a large area. This is... This could be it. Nope. There is definitely nobody here. Oh, crap. Okay, so I'm gonna be running around looking for this guy, guys. Give me one second. Is this it? Oh, Tiki is my wife who is a girl! Huh! よかった。人だ。あのすみません。ここどこでしょうか。はあ。そのノートパソコン。もしかして君がチキヨメ I mean, I guess that's I he's right. それでも地球は俺の嫁です。私の愛は性別も次元も乗り越えるんです。I don't know about that second bit, but あ、はい。The <laughs> uh, dimensions part. あの、声が聞こえたんです。私のことを呼ぶような。And you followed it to the weirdest place in Shibuya? それで気づいたら、こんなへんてこなところに。
let's just get her out of here. Itsuki told her where the exit is. Clearly. She really doesn't seem to care about her own life, dude. それにはお呼びません。来たんだから。帰れるのは道理です。あ、うん。助けてくれてありがとうございます。名もしらぬ親切な人。では、私はこれにて。Nameless kind person. That might be a good name for a band actually. And there goes Tiki equals waifu. Oh. Well, I guess we weren't meant to find out her name then. An odd presence, so there is going to be a boss fight then. Oh, a topic. Uh, I've safely rescued Tiki Eagle's waifu. Tiki? You there, Tiki? I guess not. Tiki, what happened? Something may have happened, actually. Oh, and they're gonna make us walk all the way out of here. Alright, guys, give me one second. I'm just gonna go right back to Bloom Palace for us. Got a new topic from Maiko. Let's see. I'm doing my job, so praise me! I'm practically a star myself! And... <laughs> and she sent, like, a... I actually don't even know how to describe it! You guys... You guys will have to see it. You, you'll know immediately what it means, but it's hard to describe... What uh, what type of blue it is. Um, oh, crap, uh... Dang, dude, Rave Master was actually... Now that I think about it... That was probably, like, 13 years ago at this point? So if any of you guys are like younger or like 15 or 16, you probably have no freaking clue what I'm talking about. It is um no, it isn't fairy tale too. And fairy tale is much more recent. So. You guys will be fine. Okay, now we're back and we're gonna be able to let her know about Tiki equals waifu. What is she doing? Like, like super sentai poses or something? <laughs> What's the matter, Tiki? Tiki, what happened? It looks like she was trying to practice her fighting stance. There's nothing wrong with that. I mean... I... I fully expect Tiki to become somebody's Mirage, so... <laughs> I won't. Hmm. I mean, she's got to fight eventually. Tiki was extra strong in Shadow Dragon, actually. I, she was, like, hands down overpowered. So there's no reason she shouldn't be able to fight. Oh. Now Tiki's all like listening to her songs and I wanted to repay her. Okay. Tiki. Managing all this carnage form stuff is pretty useful though. 
we are companions already. Chiki, we're not just friends anymore. I have to do something for me, and Chiki has to do something for me. I think it's important to be able to help me with my friends. And that's I was I've been thinking about that. I feel like there's no like when you have situations where everybody fights the exact same way, then I don't know a little something is lost. It's like the difference between a fight in Yu Yu Hakusho and the fight a uh, difference between a fight in DBZ. I don't know. That's just what that brings to mind. Um, clearly. Ah, Chiki is here. He's fighting. I mean, at some point, though, you might want to get on that, but for right now, it's okay. Job complete. Side story, all tiki tiki, you for reals completed. Okay. And a very small amount of XP. Tiki has become troubled Udaloy thanks to Itsuki's influence. Tiki acquired the backup skill Idala underscore safety dot exe. What are backup skills? The cast that do not participate in battle support Itsuki and friends in the background with backup skills. These abilities affect the game's general mechanics, such as the prices at which items are bought or sold. You can obtain Maiko's, Tiki's, and Barry's backup skills by completing their respective side stories. Huh, okay. The effects of Idala underscore safety dot exe. Tiki's mysterious power now lets you explore the Idolosphere more safely. From now on, the effects of items and skills with field effects will last longer. Okay. Uh... From here, let's take a look at some new Carnage forms we can make. Uh... Can we make anything new? Hopefully we can. Uh, mastered, mastered. We can make a wind spear for him. I've already made this? I'm actually not sure how I can tell if I've already made something. Hmm. Hold on, let's look at what Tomo's got on hand right now. So, just to make certain that we don't end up using resources that are otherwise better spent. Uh, items. Perform a... Oh, no. That's not it. Uh, artists. What's he working with? Uh, it doesn't say. Hmm. I guess not. Huh. Uh, yeah, and it's been forever since I've, um... There it is, wardrobe. It's been forever since I've, uh, played this game. You guys know. Spear. And we do already have the wind spear. Okay, cool. Full inheritance, full inheritance, next skill elect blaze. Okay. That's good. Um are, is this you already using the iron rod? Yeah. And Iski's next skill is uh Dia again, so. Full inheritance, full inheritance. Okay, let's change it to the Radiant Lance then. I mean, is probably gonna be one of my lesser used party members, but. <laughs> No use, uh, not doing anything with her. Okay. Now we're gonna check the performer we can make once more. Then we have an... Oh, it probably would've... I, I was... I'm fully expecting the game probably would've stopped us, honestly. And been like, hey, you've already got this. Yep, already have this carnage. Okay, that's fine. Are there... Nope, none of hers we can make. Mastered these ones except Deathbringer. Okay. 
And from here, let's check to see if we can't start, um, Kitty's side story. I don't know if we can. We didn't, we didn't fight too many battles with her when we were running around doing tiki's, but... I don't know. Let's chat her up. If not, we'll just do, um, we'll just go right into Toma's. Huh? Or... Which side story should I check up on? Oh, crap. Oh, wait! Her saint train is something that actually ranks up, isn't it? Okay, let's check Toma's topics. Um... I'm not sure if... Oh! A topic from Tiki. I'm not sure if, if Tomo's... If, if that's something we can activate or what? Um... You are amazing in Illusory 106, big brother! And then she sends a happy blue. Um... Where the heck... It'd be helpful if I could figure out where Tomo was at. Huh. Uh, F it. We know where Barry's at, so... Let's go ahead... Wait, uh, doing Barry's thing might actually, uh, push us further in the story. Don't want that just yet. Okay, I'm gonna look around for Toma, guys. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna hang out with Barry at Uzume Lesson Studio, because I, I figure that that might have just been something Toma sent. If it were an actual side story, then we'd actually be able to do it, but... Yeah. It looks like Suba's sister came back safe and sound. Another victim of the mass disappearance returns to our side. Hey! It's almost time for your training. Come on in. Uh, okay, so I guess I can't just talk to him. Uh, next chapter at the Uzume Lesson Studio. And the intermission? Uh, yeah, let's do so. Start up the next chapter. One, two, three! Hi! Chuka Bears! I really don't think I... I don't think I uh, like Barry's Japanese voice too much, but that's okay. すごい気合い入ってるね、翼。俺はついていくのがやっとだよ。曲が決まったら、なんだかやるぞって気分になっちゃって。did we already know she had her first song coming up? Hmm. That's probably... Yep. Kiria. Okay, we got another coach. That's fine. いつきも覚悟はできてる。え、俺もですか？I mean, yeah, why not? 当然よ。それじゃあ始めるわよ、二人とも。はい、キリアさん、ビシビシ愛の無知をお願いします。Ready for raining this chick? <laughs> よろしくお願いします。So formal. Dude. Oh, intermission end. All right. A star is born. Obtain the play record for it. Legit. Chapter two. Head over heels for her. And so the day of Subasa's debut came, and we'll definitely see what Subasa's debut entails. That's gonna be next time, though. So definitely join me then for more Tokyo Mirage sessions. Sharp Fe. Bye for now, guys.